Here's how to decode each of the personality types to figure out the dominant, auxiliary, tertiary, and inferior functions in five easy steps. Let's take an ESTJ as an example. Step one, look at the last letter of the type, in this case, J. The last letter tells us which function is put into the external world. In this case, J tells us that the judging function, thinking, is put into the external world, or extroverted. We write a little e next to the t. Step two, if the judging function, thinking, is extroverted, then the perceiving function, sensing, must be introverted. So we now write a little i next to the s to tell us that sensing is introverted. Step three, now we look at the first letter of the type. As this type is an extrovert, this means that the extroverted function thinking is dominant. If thinking is dominant, then the other function sensing must be the auxiliary. Step four, there are two remaining functions to decode. If the thinking function is dominant and gets the most amount of energy, then the least amount of energy must go to the opposite function, feeling. This is the inferior function. The orientation of the inferior is also opposite to the dominant function and so is introverted. Step five, finally, the tertiary function is always the opposite of the auxiliary function. In this case, the opposite of sensing is intuition. So now we have deduced that an ESTJ is an extroverted dominant thinking type with auxiliary introverted sensing, tertiary intuition, and inferior introverted feeling.